Hello guys, welcome back to Sophia X. I'm having a wonderful day. Well, I'm on episode 6, season 1 of One Tree Hill. So without further ado, let's dive into this video. Oh my god, I did this. <laughs> Is that Danny and Lucas? Uh, not Dan, uh, Nathan? Sorry. Brooke? That's not normal. I want to write an episode. Oh, okay. That's going to be interesting. I wanted to say thanks. Wow, you made me a mix. Is this me more dating? Listen, you've got a long bus ride tonight. How did you jump time. to that conclusion? Right, you should come. You always beat the crap out of the Pickerington Hicks. They're called the Hicks? Oh no, but they should be. <laughs> the place is all trucks and <laughs> We'll go, we'll enjoy a nice adult evening downtown. Yeah, you probably need to spend like more adult quality time than I'm just saying. It's not a date, we're just going together. Why would you say that? You guys hang out a lot and you get along well. Yeah, well, I get along with the guy who delivers our water. It doesn't mean I'm going to date him. Yeah, but the guy who delivers our water is not Keith. Oh, <laughs> Where's his nice points. Well, Keith didn't say something to you, did he? Oh, you mean about the day that you two aren't going on tonight? <laughs> not a word. No yelling at your best friend because you broke up with your jerk of a boyfriend? Oh, my God, a smile. <laughs> All right. <laughs> get your skinny ass up and let's go beat the pirates. Oh, it's she's it's wild. wild. You sit there with your mouth shut <laughs> and focus. <laughs> Got a long way. I'll choose the music. Tonight's theme <laughs> is defense. <laughs> Did you see that? <laughs> I saw that. I don't know what I think. I think Nathan likes Tudor Girl, but I think Tudor Girl likes Lucas. And I know I like Lucas, and I don't know who the hell you like anymore. <laughs> This is all turning into one big love. Hey, Haley's looking pretty fine tonight, right? Can't wait to get with that. Nathan. Hey, so I saw Nathan in the shower. Yeah, no wonder you broke up with him. <gasps> oh my god, oh my god. Oh, you're crushing Brooke for God's sake. I don't give diddly squat about your issues with your daddy or your <laughs> girlfriends. But if you're gonna play on my team, you're gonna learn how to work together. You got 30 some odd miles to figure it out. <laughs> I should have figured. Can't this is why this game. Ah, oh, that's too tight. Yeah, how's that? Too loose. Oh, that's too tight. Brooke is freaking something. It's really strong painkillers, so just take like half one every 12 hours. Broke. Why do you want my life so bad anyway, man? <laughs> you don't flatter yourself, are right? you? But the last person I want to trade places with. I wouldn't take that ride if I was you. You're not me. You never will be. That's perfect! Brooke, you can come with us. Ask your name, hey, Brooke. Peyton, can she come? Please? Peyton, please! <gasps> oh my god, I love this. Wait, your name is Thing? That's right. Thing. Yeah, and I'm Thing 1. Okay, wait, let, let me guess. <laughs> thing 2. Thing 3. Because I'm third. <laughs> well, well, well. Oh, no, don't tell me Isn't it's Dan's table. Hi, Karen. Hi. How are we going to pull that off? Would you card us? I don't think so. <laughs> don't you two like the same guys? Or guy or something. <laughs> I'm just tutoring him, that's all. So you're not into him? Because he seems to be into you. Uh, weird. What about you and Lucas? And Vanus? Oh, come on. Tortured artist meets tortured athlete. Talk about your obvious attractions. <laughs> yeah, yeah, all right, all right, yahoo! Yeah, enough to make you with clothes. <laughs> Don't they say please in the suburbs? He said give us our clothes. Basically, you guys beat the hell out of each other for our amusement. <laughs> The one left oh standing gets his clothes and a ride to a phone. Are right, you can screw yourself? Because there's no way in hell that the toolbox is going to fight. Oh. Nathan! Oh Maybe my god. Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, Nathan. You okay? Yeah. Oh. All right. Give him his sweats. Well, that's worth the house, King. Hey, keep him coming. 
I saw a gas station a few miles back. If I'm not back in an hour, tell my mom I loved her. <laughs> Don't you mean Nathan? I could suffocate in here. <laughs> you did crack a window, right? <laughs> was it really my influence, Dad? Because I, I thought it was Deb's money that bankrolled your dream. <laughs> True. Oh, tenfold. this is why. And every good businessman knows it's talk about being a self-made man, but self-made into what? Oh God, I want to just punch him. So you didn't answer my question. I'm liking this. Like I'm liking him? this friendship. It's not it's actually a friendship, matter. but I <laughs> hope it will be. Would you say yes if he asked you out? It depends. What song is playing? <laughs> Man in good mood. Is he smiling when he asks, or is he doing that that goofy brooding thing he does? <laughs> oh, you know, I think he's he's definitely doing the brooding. He thing. does it all the time. You and Karen really go nicely together. Mm, she sees it too. I don't think she sees me that way. I know it's none of my business, but why do you? Why do I stay with him? Yeah, that's my question. Yeah. Some days he's the man I fell in love with, and other days. I don't know. Oh, man. Oh, my God. So, with Please, no Bond. Please. Thank you, wife, for this. Uh, Everything <laughs> sucks. It won't work. Put anywhere. Bail. Bail. <laughs> Second guess, what'd you think of it? You wanna do it? Watch out for the golf ball. <laughs> oh, oh. Ah. Faith oh. is laughing. Dude, who knew you were like the fourth Charlie's oh, Angel? Oh, this is crazy. <laughs> I didn't see her laugh like this before. You should consider yourself lucky sometimes. Lucky to not have a dad? At least this one. So, you know, he got up to the plate. And there's nobody on base, so I just walked them. So my dad calls a timeout, thinking he's gonna say, like, smart move or good thinking something, something like that. Instead, he grabs me by the arm and he kicks me in the ass as hard as he can. Kick me so hard. Oh my god. Oh my god. That's some abusive shit. So just think about that next time you're feeling sorry for yourself. Nathan! Oh my god, he has a heart of gold, just saying. I didn't Nathan, think I, I would say that, uh, but he just really call is. Me, he didn't have to say something like what? this to him. And not only he opened what up to doing, him, Rosie? he told him not to feel, right, to feel you know, sorry for himself. You know, maybe you ought to spend a little less time worrying about my relationship and a little more time paying attention to your own. T. If you call chasing after my leftovers a relationship, If I were her, I'd fucking okay. murder him. Okay. <laughs> what are we doing hiding from these idiots anyway, huh? But I can hold my own. And I know that you could throw a pretty damn good punch. I love this. Nathan got thrown out of the game tonight for fighting with Lucas. Fighting with his brother. Hmm. Wonder where he gets that from. Yep. Nathan's prospects took a huge blow tonight. Can we just focus on him? That's the wrong answer, Dan. <sighs> what is she doing here? You invited her. <laughs> just happened already. I love you. I oh, said. Tragic. You two don't actually think you're gonna be friends tomorrow, do you? Uh, Look, man, you didn't have to get in that car when those guys grabbed me. Hey, whatever. You know the way I see it. I mean, if they would have taken you out, who the hell am I gonna fight with, right? Oh my gosh, Nathan with Lucas. This <laughs> happens sometimes. For much more than a moment, yeah, sound oh, stopped. I really want them to be friends. For much, much more than a moment. So we like teased us with a potential relationship and like, that's it? Are you kidding me? For this episode, you guys, I loved it. 
finally things are starting to change between the main characters we got like a glimpse of how things could be between them and just really beautiful like there's so much potential in there and to think that Dan was not only pushing his son Nathan but abusing him you guys that really breaks my heart and Nathan really really grew on me and based off like this past four episodes three episodes and in this episode I just realized how amazing he is when he wants to be it really gives an insight into why Nathan is the way he is and I think Lucas was finally able to see that as well for the first time why his wisdom came in handy as usual and as expected we finally got a moment to see these two brothers bonding and man i see so much potential in this bromance i'm just saying and rook 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 she's something she's freaking queen she's so beautiful sensitive and like hilarious even when there's like a bitchy side of her as well and Peyton I loved how Peyton was in this episode she laughed more than she did in the past six episodes combined and that mostly because of Hayley they really 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 got along well together it's beautiful to see anyways guys I absolutely love 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 this episode thank you for watching I've enjoyed my reaction see you in another video bye